Kids Food Basket has set a goal to collect 200,000 decorated paper eggs by the end of the month. Here to tell us how it's all going is CEO of Kids Food Basket, Bridget Clark Whitney. How you doing, my friend? Hi, thank you so much for having us. Really grateful to be talking about Brown Bag Decorating Day. This is the, I believe, 12th year that we have done Brown Bag Decorating Day. So we're really excited about it. We're super pumped about the community enthusiasm. And every single decorated bag means a touch of love. Yes, and people love doing this because you can do it as a family, you can do it as a church group, as a business, and everybody just really loves, like you say, to put their personal touch on it. Yeah, you bet. You know, this is something, too, that, like, anywhere in the world you can decorate a bag, and you're truly doing a service. You're truly showing up for your neighbors. You're truly brightening somebody's day, right? And just the idea of, of art therapy, too, taking some time, draw a decoration on a bag. A lot of people say, well, I'm not an artist. You don't need to be an artist. Mine are all inspirational messages. You are an awesome person. Have a great day. Like, remember that you are loved. So an opportunity to really either make some sort of an art, share an inspirational message, Again, it is that touch of love. Teachers tell us all the time, for the past 12 years, teachers tell us all the time, the first thing that kids do when they get their kids' food basket meal is they look on the bag to see whether or not it's been decorated. Every single bag is a gift. And so this is an opportunity for us to create a lot of momentum here in the West Michigan community, create really a spirit campaign. Anybody can be involved. Anyone can really make a difference through this movement. That's what's so great about Kids' Food Basket, too, because you can come in. It is so tangible too. You, you, you come in and, and you know that that piece of fruit and that sandwich that you're doing, putting it into that decorated bag is going to a child. Yeah, absolutely right here in West Michigan. It's so important right now. 552,000 children here in Michigan alone are living in food insecure households, which means homes that simply do not have enough resources for healthy food. But healthy nourishing food is the foundation of good health. Good health is the foundation of a good future. All of our children, all of our families, everyone deserves the opportunity to be healthy and thrive, right? And to maximize on educational opportunities. So that's what Kids Food Rescue is all about. We're all about healthy food access. This brown bag decorated is creating awareness about the importance of this work, but it's also about amplifying our love for one another, right? Showing up for your neighbors, being a good community member, showing up for our neighbors in our community that, that may be less fortunate or that may need some resources right now. And it's just a way, again, to share that love. And you said it, Michelle, it is an opportunity. You can do it in a faith community. You can do it at school. Bring bags into your business. Leave them in the lobby. Leave them in a waiting room. We see just so many opportunities where people take the time to decorate great bags. Restaurants will do it while people are waiting for tables. It's just a really great way to stay connected to community and to do something good. Yeah, it sure is. You have a final event this Thursday. How can people take part in that? You bet. And so at Kids Food Basket on site from 1230 to 6 p.m. on Thursday is official brown bag decorating day. We're asking people stop by. We've got bags. We've got markers. We've got stencils and crayons. Take some time. Do some art. Make make a difference. Make a day, right? Every single one of those bags, a touch of love. We'll also have food vendors here. We'll have lots of great snacks as well. And just a good way to get involved and do some important volunteering on Thursday. Yeah. So again, it's 1230 the entire community is welcome. All right, great. Bridget, always great to see you. Thank you so much. Always great to see you as well. Thanks for having us today. And uh, welcome, Brown Bag Decorating Week. Come on down.